Hi guys, welcome back. My name is Veroy from The Real Collective and today we are here to bring you guys a red hot listing in Canberra. Hmm. No, 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 no. Not the Australia Canberra, but we are Canberra of Singapore. Let's check it out right now. Let's go. So Brownstone is situated in Canberra, an estate within Sambawang, a place with rich history. Named after the capital of Australia, roads at the former Singapore naval base were coined after former British colonies and territories. This residential estate in the far north of Singapore is currently undergoing a rapid, exciting phase of development. So this newly MOP EC at the Brownstone is developed by City Development Limited, CDL, and also a Lao Tzu Hao in developing high-quality condominiums as well as ECs. Of course, ECs are getting tremendous attention these days with the recent Copen Grand selling at 75% and I believe this is due to the reason that ECs are often built with the practicality of the growing families in mind and the quality, finishes and facilities just make absolute sense. So now let's understand this development, the brownstone, together. So this unit consists of 638 units spread over 8 blocks with 12 floors in total. And today we are touring a unit that's located on a high floor at block 150 situated at the corner and it features dual views of the swimming pool and the open unblocked view. Alright, so now let's take a trip around the facility stack. Let's go! Choo choo! Okay, so right now we're actually at the rooftop garden level and as you can see, I love the amount of lush greenery this place has to offer. Right behind me, we actually have a half basketball court and right behind me on this side, we actually have a full-size tennis court as well. Say hi to our crew over here. So we have the kids playground over here and what do we have on this side? So this is actually the skating ring if you guys know how to rollerblade. You can blade around circles over here. But if you guys are more adventurous, right downstairs, next to your development, there is an amazing park over there where you can go and do your evening strolls or your rollerblading or your longboarding or skating, whichever you like. Choose your poison. So before we check out the unit, let's appreciate the floor plan together. Let's check it out. The unit has a built-in area of 958 square feet with a total of 3 bedrooms, 2 bathrooms, a service yard, a utility room as well as a helper's bathroom. The main orientation from the balcony is predominantly towards the north and the main door is facing towards the south orientation. So guys, welcome to this unit. This is 958 square feet, 3 bed, 2 bath comes with a utility room, a service yard and a helper's bathroom. Now immediately when you guys step into this place, your eyes will be immediately drawn to the openness of the balcony over here. Guys, check this out. Let's go. So why I love outdoor spaces, I believe right with the recent two years of lockdown, more and more people are actually understanding the importance of outdoor spaces and this regular sized balcony is really perfect. What the owner has actually done right here is that they have actually decked out the space so there is a seamless uh, transition from the living into the uh, balcony area and at the same time also installing automated zip tracks which allow you guys to enclose this entire space and if you guys are doing entertaining and stuff just open up the balconies and the entire space will be very very connected all your aircon will be kept within this entire space all right come let's check out the rest of the space together let's go So now, let's check out the main spaces of the house. So, the living dining is right next to each other and what the owner has also chose to design this space. It is given a modernistic vibe. Of course, I love the dark wooden finishes and of course, with the mirrors and the lighting play, it makes this entire space a really, really cohesive and romantic vibe. So the cove lighting actually presents a softer feel, giving this entire space a really welcoming vibe.
Okay, so for this layout, you actually have a few configurations for you guys to place your dining set. What I love about this owner is that they actually chose to do a, some sort of built-in cabinetry over here. Now, making this space very compact and functional. Right below, you also have storage spaces for you to keep your clutter away. Now, this opens up a lot of space right over on this side where you can perhaps put up maybe like some bookshelves. You have kids, you can actually make some toy cabinets for them to keep their toys away. Very, very important for the growing family. Now at the entrance over here, there is also shoe cabinet provision by the developer. But if that's not enough, this actually presents a really, really good option for you guys to have extra shoe space. Everybody loves small shoe space and this doubles up as a sitting area for you guys to put on your shoes before you head out. All right, now, now let's check out the kitchen together. Let's go. Okay, so welcome to the kitchen. Now for three bedrooms, we always, always need to have an enclosed kitchen and more importantly, you have an opening over here to let the fumes up when you guys do your master chef cooking. Okay, what the owner has done and I totally appreciate the fact that they have chosen a color palette outside that complements with the kitchen space itself with the dark wood tones, the thin profile quartz top as well as this fabric look alike finish laminate on the upper cabinets itself. And here, of course, you have your hood, hot and oven and the sink directly next to it. Behind me, you have a large space for your fridge as well as extra storage too. Okay, now back over here, we also have something really, really rare for three bedrooms over here, which is a service yard. Now, most of the new developments these days don't offer you the option of a service yard, but this, you guys get a service yard, a helper's room, as well as a helper's bathroom all together in this 958 square feet unit. So this allows a lot of cross ventilation in the entire house, especially when you guys cook. Okay, so from where we are right now, we are actually a brownstone throw away from the MRT station. Get it? So it takes less than 3 minutes walk to reach Canberra MRT station and over there you have Canberra Plaza which offer you more than 120,000 square feet worth of retail therapy from popular fast food chains like a w KFC, McDonald's, 2, NTUC, Daiso and more and I'm certain this will be able to serve your daily needs. Looking for variety? Just hop on the train and one stop later you will arrive at Yishun where you will get North Point City which gives you a staggering one. 1.2 million square footage of retail therapy and the best part just jump onto the train and head into town or CBD in just less than 35 minutes all right now let's go on to the bedrooms but before we do that right along this corridor you also have this extra storage area which is really really deep where you guys can possibly put additional shelves uh, for more storage as well or if not you can actually put your uh, ironing boards uh, vacuum cleaners daily necessities and gro not groceries lah, but more of your shower items, you know, soap, bar, toilet paper, all can go inside. Now, bedrooms, let's go. Okay, so for the common bathroom, let's go. Over here, right, the entire treatment color scheme is a little bit on the darker tones, including the floor tiles, which is of a darker color. Now, this is super practical because when guests use your common bathroom, this makes it a lot easier to maintain. And at the same time, this bathroom also has a window opening, which helps a lot with ventilation. Okay, so now right into the master. Check it out. Wow! I think that the entire vibe really ties in together really, really well. You have, of course, a built-in headboard, 
finish with LED lightings at the side. Now this gives it another soft romantic vibe. At the same time, all the three bedrooms have a three-quarter glass window opening that actually brings in a lot of natural lighting as well. What we have over here, now this is actually a built-in bed frame which actually accommodates right now a queen-size bed and right below you also have additional storage which makes it really really practical as well. And as I mentioned, right, like the newly MOPECs, right, are really built for practicality because of their amazing layout. And this space over here still allows you guys, right, to put in a dresser with your drawers over here where you can put in all your, you know, made hu siu siu, right, so that you guys can look pretty and awesome before heading out. And now, let's check out the ensuite bathroom. Now the ensuite bathroom has a totally different vibe as compared to the common bathroom because it has this bold black tiles that contrast really really well with the light coloured homogeneous tiles making this entire space really really easy to love and of course ventilation right behind this door you have a window to make this space really nice and dry. Canberra is a newly developed location in between Sambawang and Yishun and there's definitely more to look forward in the future. Walk, jog or cycle along a picturesque canal from Canberra Station to the seaside at Sambawang Park, home to one of Singapore's natural beaches and during the day, white-throated kingfishers can be spotted along the 4km park connector. Head down to Bukit Canberra, a $1.5 billion, 12 hectare integrated sports and community hub that is going to house the largest active SG gym. Five swimming pools, a library, an 800-seater hawker centre, polyclinic and more. This location is truly jam-packed with endless plans from now to the future which makes this purchase a surefire upward trend development. Alright, so if you guys want to visit this amazing 3-bed, three 3-bath three MOPEC at the Brownstone, you know who to call, contact Veroy from The Real Collective, real people, real estate, real results and we will see you soon.